Manx folklore is not something in the past. Manx folklore is something which is always with us. It started with a phone call from James Franklin, and um, basically he'd seen my photography, he liked it, and thought we could adapt it to illustrate some of the old Manx myths and legends. Well, folklore is so important to the Isle of Man because it's the story of the people. It's things which people have seen, experienced. These stories would have lived with Manx people. The Isle of Man was full of stories and still is full of, full of stories. And these stories are folklore. 40 stories, 40 very different pictures in some cases. A lot of thought, a lot of work, a lot of imagination to try and bring the stories to life. But ultimately, it's nice to try and push those boundaries of creativity, to try and obtain what we were trying to show in the pieces of folklore. So it was, it, it, it was a bit of a stretch, but I think it's quite good to do that, because it does push you a little bit harder to create something. Seeing us, um, images for the first time mm. was, um, you know, they're just very, they're just extraordinary, mm. beautiful. So, yeah, I mean, that's really our main job is sort of to, well, one of our mm. jobs is really to bring artists' work, you know, to the forefront uh, mm. so that the island's public can see it. Mm -hmm. I think in selecting for this exhibition, uh, we chose 40 images and I had to whittle that down from however many there are. There's an endless amount and you could walk down any street, go into any sort of cafe or pub and talk to people and they would give you new stories, strange things they have seen, things they've heard, interesting things. And these are stories which are all around us and always will be. And it's so important to not think that the Isle of Man is a bland place when nothing happens. This place is teeming with life and meaning and stories. And this is, I think we've kind of managed it in these photographs. We've sort of suggested things rather than put out a solid image of what we think a fairy or a phenodery looks like. Um, and these suggestions, these grainy, gloomy, misty images uh, seem to work quite well at lending themselves, suggesting what these creatures might have been. And I think we talk about a darkness in the imagery, but actually, really, there's a, there's a sense of light in a lot of them. There's a sense space. of stillness, space. space again. You know, you talk. I don't know. There's a sanctity in there somehow as well. Mm. I just think it's just a really, yeah, just really beautiful artwork. You just mm. need to see it. This is not pictures of history. This is pictures of the Isle of Man and who we are as Manx people.